Now, NBC5 First Warning Weather, the area's certified most accurate forecast. Well, it's going to be shorts weather tomorrow, right? Shorts mm. weather. Going to be good. Going to be good. We've been waiting for a while. I mean, some people think it's a little early, and it is a month early on average, but... Uh, that first one is always a little special after winter, the long winter, right? So special. Yeah, 83 is the forecast. If you're wondering what's typical, we usually have an 80 degree day on May 11th. That's usually the first one just based on the averages. Earliest on record is March 20th, so this is not anywhere close to earliest on record, but it will stand out and it will feel that way tomorrow. And it's really melting the snow on Mount Mansfield. As of today, we're right at average, not above, not below, sitting right at 70 inches for the depth on top of the mountain. Now, typically the depth plunges off here going into May, but it's likely to start going even below average considering how warm things are in the next uh, couple of days. So storm trackers mostly dry, a couple of clouds in the Northeast Kingdom as the warm air continues to surge in. Church Street is dry tonight and mild 52 with a calm wind. We're looking at storm trackers showing the, uh, well, the warmth coming from the south and west, 62 in Bennington right now, 42 in Saranac Lake. And then as you get out, really anywhere west of us, that's where the warm dome is. See how it gets all the way up in the northern Michigan? 56 in Alpena right now, 68 in Detroit. So this whole thing is just moving right over us into tomorrow, Friday, and the weekend. Really, the whole weekend looks pretty good. So sunshine all the way through tomorrow with highs in the lower 80s. The only slight adjustment to Friday is there's a sneaky, brief backdoor cold front that comes in with clouds and nothing more than that. But it likely drops the temperatures 5 degrees on Friday. It still feels like summer on Friday. There's no change to that part of the idea. As we get into Saturday, though, that'll wash out and go north, and we'll have sun and about 80 again. So to summarize the summer preview, it really does go all the way to Sunday. You could say four days if you wanted. It just starts to cool off a little bit on Sunday, and then the bigger cold front comes in Sunday night going into Monday with a round of rain. So there will be some new records tomorrow, most likely getting close to record territory in Burlington, Montpelier, and Lebanon. See how the forecast in Montpelier is 81. The record is 79 from back in 1968. So likely to fall tomorrow, and we'll let you know about that when it happens. So tonight is quiet and mostly clear, staying mild, actually warming up in some cases by tomorrow morning by a few degrees, and then skyrocketing low 80s on the New York side of Lake Champlain tomorrow. 75 for Saranac Lake, getting to 83 as you heard in Burlington, same for Virgins. And then down towards the mass border, we're thinking 83 as well for Brattleboro. So here comes the little cool down on Friday, 75. It's still way above for this time of year. 80 on Saturday, 75 Sunday. The showers hold off till overnight into Monday. And then impact weather on Monday with rain, either periods of rain or, or a few showers but it definitely cools us off in a big way. 51, that's it for Tuesday. Brian, Alice? All right, Tyler.